New York State is making some adjustments to the general minimum wage rate and paid family leave as the year wraps up. Christian Garzone has more on what this means for your pocketbook going into 2019. John, starting on December 31st, workers in Rochester and the rest of upstate can expect a minimum wage of $11.10 per hour, which is up from the $10.40 minimum wage as it stands now. The remainder of New York, primarily New York City and Long Island, will have higher minimum wage rates, with big employers in New York giving $15 an hour. Also helping out financially on January 1st, the number of weeks eligible employees can take off with a new child, care for a sick family member, or assist loved ones when a family member is deployed abroad in military service. Uh, deployed abroad overseas in military service will increase to 10 weeks. The paid family leave wage replacement benefit is also increasing. Employees taking paid family leave will receive 55% of their average weekly wage, up to a cap of 55% of the current statewide average weekly wage of roughly $1,357. The maximum weekly benefit for 2019 is $746.41. Governor Cuomo says with all these changes and increases in New York State, quote, continues to set a national example in the fight for economic justice. John. All right, Christian, thank you. For more information on minimum wage increases in New York's paid family leave policy, you can visit the links attached to this article at rochesterfirst.com.